Hello students, after discussing G-protein coupled receptors, in today's video we are going to study second category of transducer mechanisms that is ligand gated ion channels also known as ion channel receptor. Now this video is 10th in the series of videos on pharmacodynamics. Now as we all know transducer mechanism is a process by which an external signal in the form of ligand is converted to biological response by a cell. Now ion channel receptors are cell surface receptors. Look at this figure. It shows a cell membrane. Outside the cell is present the extracellular fluid and inside the cell is present the intracellular fluid that is the cytoplasm. And these are the uh, ion channel receptors and these receptors are surface cell surface receptors. Now these receptors they enclose or they incorporate ion channels within their structure. Now these uh, receptors they are pentameric. That means each receptor is made up of five subunits. One, two, three, four and five. And all the five subunits are arranged around the ionic channel. And receptor also bears a ligand binding site. This is the, one of the ligand binding site. This is another ligand binding site. Now binding of ligand to these receptors either open or close the ionic channels that are enclosed within these receptors. Now look at this figure. Here acetylcholine is the ligand. It is a neurotransmitter. It's a chemical messenger. It is a signal that is received by the cell. So acetylcholine binds to nicotinic cholinergic receptors which are located at the neuromuscular junction. Now very important to remember here that nicotinic cholinergic receptors are ligand gated ion channels and binding of acetylcholine to these receptors open sodium channels and sodium ions move inside the cell. Now movement of ions constitute the signaling pathway and since the ions possess electrical charge this changes the electrical property of the cell and thus extracellular signal induced by the binding of ligand to the receptor is converted to the intracellular electrical signal and that produces the physiological response. So as discussed acetylcholine binds to nicotinic cholinergic receptors that causes the opening of sodium channels. There is influx of sodium ions that means sodium ions moves inside the cell and that produces the physiological response that produces the contraction of skeletal muscles. So this is how ligand gated ion channels or ion channel receptors produce the physiological response. So if you find the video useful, kindly like, subscribe and share this video. Thanks for watching this video. 